What is dynamic water level? The dynamic water level is the level of groundwater in an aquifer that is affected by pumping or recharge activities. It represents the fluctuation in the water level caused by changes in the rate of water withdrawal or recharge. This means that the dynamic water level can vary depending on the amount of water being pumped out of the aquifer or the amount of water being recharged back into the aquifer. When groundwater is pumped out of an aquifer, the water level drops, and this is reflected in the dynamic water level. The rate of water withdrawal, the size and depth of the well, and the properties of the aquifer all affect the rate at which the water level drops. Similarly, when water is recharged into an aquifer, the water level rises, and this is reflected in the dynamic water level. The rate of recharge and the properties of the aquifer determine the rate at which the water level rises. Measuring the dynamic water level is important for monitoring the response of the aquifer to pumping and recharge activities. This information can help in managing groundwater resources by ensuring sustainable use of the aquifer and preventing overexploitation. For example, if the dynamic water level drops too low, it may indicate that the rate of pumping is too high, and this can lead to reduced water availability and poor water quality. On the other hand, if the dynamic water level rises too high, it may indicate that the recharge rate is too high, and this can lead to waterlogging and other negative impacts. In summary, the dynamic water level is an important parameter for understanding the response of an aquifer to pumping and recharge activities. It provides valuable information for managing groundwater resources and ensuring sustainable use of the aquifer. By monitoring the dynamic water level, we can prevent overexploitation, maintain water quality, and protect the environment and socioeconomic activities that rely on groundwater. What is static water level? The static water level is the level of groundwater in an aquifer when it is not being pumped out or recharged. It represents the natural equilibrium between the rate of water recharge and the rate of water discharge in the aquifer. This means that when there is no pumping or other influences on the aquifer, the water level will stabilize at a certain depth below the ground surface. The static water level can vary depending on several factors such as the season, climate, geological conditions, and the amount of rainfall in the area. To measure the static water level, a well is drilled into the aquifer and a water level meter is used to measure the depth to the water surface. This measurement can help in determining the quantity and quality of water available for use, as well as the capacity of the aquifer to recharge and store water. The static water level is an important parameter in groundwater management as it provides information on the water availability and sustainability of the aquifer. When the static water level drops below a certain level, it indicates that the aquifer is being overexploited, and this can lead to a decline in water quality, as well as other environmental and socioeconomic impacts. On the other hand, if the static water level is too high, it may indicate the need for additional drainage measures to prevent waterlogging and other negative impacts. In summary, the static water level is a critical parameter for understanding the water availability and sustainability of an aquifer. It provides valuable information for managing groundwater resources and preventing overexploitation, which can have significant environmental and socioeconomic consequences. What are the differences between dynamic and static water level? The static water level and dynamic water level are both important parameters for understanding groundwater resources, but they represent different aspects of the groundwater system. The static water level is the natural equilibrium level of groundwater in an aquifer when there is no pumping or recharge activities taking place. It represents the depth at which the water table stabilizes in the absence of any external influences. The static water level is determined by the natural balance between the rate of water recharge and the rate of water discharge in the aquifer. It is an important parameter for assessing the overall availability and quality of groundwater resources, as well as for determining the capacity of the aquifer to store and release water. In contrast, 
the dynamic water level is the level of groundwater in an aquifer that is affected by pumping or recharge activities. It represents the fluctuation in the water level caused by changes in the rate of water withdrawal or recharge. The dynamic water level can vary depending on the amount of water being pumped out of the aquifer or the amount of water being recharged back into the aquifer. It is an important parameter for monitoring the response of the aquifer to pumping and recharge activities and for managing groundwater resources. One of the key differences between static and dynamic water levels is that the static water level is a stable parameter, while the dynamic water level is subject to change depending on the rate of pumping or recharge. The static water level provides a baseline for understanding the natural conditions of the aquifer, while the dynamic water level provides information on how the aquifer responds to human activities. Another difference between the two parameters is that the static water level is generally measured at a single point in time, while the dynamic water level is measured over time, often through continuous monitoring. This is because the dynamic water level is subject to fluctuations and changes over time, while the static water level is a more stable and predictable parameter. In summary, the static water level and dynamic water level are both important parameters for understanding groundwater resources, but they represent different aspects of the groundwater system. The static water level represents the natural equilibrium level of groundwater in an aquifer, while the dynamic water level represents the level of groundwater that is affected by pumping or recharge activities. Both parameters are critical for managing groundwater resources and ensuring sustainable use of this important natural resource. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications.